Hey YouTube, Ray Mayhem here, gonna be kind of an update as to what all's going on. Doing a little bit of work in the shop today. Show you. This is my self-propelled big old mower. I like this one, my wife hates it. Self-propelled, it works good. It's got the rear bagger and all that stuff. Got all the exotic stuff on it, but it's really, really heavy. But it's self-propelled. But she still doesn't like it. So we got her that one. Nice little light one and everything. And we use that for the stuff around the, the house. And then we use this one around uh, uh, for rough cutting and everything. Broke. You can see it. Broke. So what we are doing today took part of uh, this is an old one we've had for 10 years. I think I bought it at a a yard sale for five or six dollars it didn't run but you know of course you make it run for a little while and we we had it forever we're finally getting rid of that thing because i'm tired of uh working on it and cleaning the carburetor took part of the bracket off of it and we're just going to swap everything over to uh make this one work better more come but doesn't it look like a little lawnmower that a midget we use? Of course, you can't call them little midgets. That's offensive. You gotta call them little some bitches. Doesn't that look like a mower that a little some bitch would use? I think so. More to come, guys. Now, I do want to show you. As I come across opportunities to use my different different tools, I try to uh, make a point of using them. This is a strap wrench, uh, similar to a chain wrench, but um, not quite as heavy duty. And like for these guys right here, this was frozen on there. And you just put it on there, snug it, and you can un unbolt damn near anything. It's just really handy to have. Like I said, it's almost like a chain wrench, but not quite as good. So more to come guys but before see that's how this guy's sitting so he's just hanging pretty bad all right now more to come. okay guys you can see where it was broken and then it's going to be the new replacement that's going on there the exact same length same width I already measured it <laughs> same amount of rust is on both of them it's just uh, the other one's not going to be sheared off so I'm going to go ahead and swap it over and get it fitted more to come and this will save me I was either going to sleeve it uh, putting some uh, uh, a steel bar up through it and then tacking it in place or uh, I was going to just re-weld it but the weld wouldn't have held and uh, the sleeve would have looked kind of ugly this will go back and look factory. More to come guys. <laughs> 